everybody, so I wanted to let you know that Ethan doesn't always pack his school lunch. More often than not, he does eat at school, but on the rare occasion that he does have a pack lunch, I will film them for you. For us, we let Ethan decide whether or not he wants to have a school lunch or a packed lunch the night before. He's going to go ahead and have chicken roll-ups, and all that's on here is chicken, deli meat, and then inside is Colby Jack cheese. There's nothing else on there. And then in here is just cottage cheese and cherry tomatoes cut up. And then this is cut up pears. And then to drink, we just get these little mini 100% juice Minute Maid drinks here. We usually do fruit punch or apple juice. So his ice is still pretty cold. Did your, your stuff stay cold? Yeah. So you didn't have any warm stuff in here? Did. Cool. Cool, cool, cool. that all. Okay, so both it's his little freezer packs will stay cold. Okay, so we ate all of our wrap-ups. Did you like those? Yeah. Okay. We ate all... Why'd you take that off your lid? I don't know. You didn't? I oh, okay, it must have just fell off. I guess those fall off after they thaw. Because this did not stay as cold. Cold very long. Was your cottage cheese still cold? Um, still cold. Okay. Well, at least it stayed cold for lunch. So that's good. So all the cottage cheese and it was still in there. Oh, it must have just pops off when it falls out or something. I don't know. Mm. And then did you eat all your pears? Uh, yeah. Yeah. Can you open that? I can't open it. Mommy's hands are slippery. All right, awesome job, dude. Did that keep you full? Yeah. All right, you ready for school snack? Yeah. Okay. Pasta salad or Italian cold pasta salad. Uh, olives, cucumbers, green peppers, and tomatoes with a little bit of cheese, and then the noodles. He loves that stuff, so I made a big batch of it to have for lunches at home and at school. Ham and cheese sandwich. And then we have strawberry applesauce in here, and then we just have these little mini uh, fruit punch 100% juice Minute Maid. Um, but he did eat most of your pasta. Um, let's see. Sandwich. All gone. And I love these Rubbermaids, guys, because the ice pack attaches right to the bottom or the top. Um, works really well, so I really like those. Alright, that's all gone. There is some food at the bottom of here. This is all going to have to get washed. Alright. You didn't eat any of your applesauce? And then you didn't eat any of your applesauce? I didn't want to. You didn't want it? Okay. So, out of everything, you didn't have time? Yeah. Okay. Okay. Day three. We've got, again, ham and cheese. So, it's just Colby Jack cheese with honey ham. We've got the same juice drinks that we've been doing. And then, he asked for cottage cheese and tomatoes again. He really likes that. Um, sometimes, we'll put cucumbers in instead of cottage cheese. Or, instead of tomatoes. And then we have the cinnamon apples. Now, I do this because he is one of those kids that likes to, he'll eat a plain apple, no problem, but if it's brown, he won't eat it because he thinks it's gone bad. So, what I do is I put cinnamon over it, and then he does not know any better. <laughs> um, he also likes to dip his apples in yogurt or peanut butter, but because peanut butter is, is allowed at our school, they just separate the kids. They have like a peanut butter section of the cafeteria um, and a non and everything else is for everybody else. Um, we just do keep safe. You know, we do no peanut butter. So it all Ethan ate. Okay, so there's a bit of sandwich left. Ooh. There's no cottage cheese left, so that's good. And apples left. So, he really didn't eat much today. Some days he's really hungry, and other days he's just not feeling it, so. Must have been one of those days that he just wasn't feeling it. She is having a ham sandwich. I am needing to go to the grocery store, so this is kind of a thrown together lunch for me. Um, we also have these Triscuits here, so I gave him a handful of those. And they're actually the Triscuit, fire roasted tomato and olive. Um, he really likes these. 
So we're going to try a couple other flavors, but we all really like these. And a lot of times we'll put like a piece of mozzarella or something up on top. Um, we've got cottage cheese, pears, and then I do have a bigger drink because he said that those little ones are not enough. And he was buying milk right along with um, his juice. So I went ahead and just upped the size of his juice. Okay, and this is what I opened my son's lunchbox up to. He does not click the lids on these very well. Um, otherwise, they don't spill because I have tried them and they don't spill. So this is like user error. <laughs> um, these fit and fresh do fine. But um, it doesn't look like he ate very much of the pears. I think it all just spilled. Um, he ate one cracker. I put five in there. <laughs> he ate one part of his sandwich. There's all the pears down there. Oh my goodness. And all of his cottage cheese. So, <laughs> and his juice is all gone. But yeah, that just means I need to wash out this thing again. 